Hallelujah, hallelujah. 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 Yeah. Come on, sing to Randall.
said to those Jews who believed him, if you abide in my word, you are my disciples indeed. You shall know the truth and the truth shall set you free. Somebody been bound too long. But I want to thank God today with about a hundred more people that he picked me up, turned me around, set my feet on a solid ground. I want to thank him today. I want to pray him. Yep, yep. I want to thank him today that he turned me around. Yep, yep, yep. I'm telling somebody, get out of the grave. Get out of the bondage. He can do it. Say it again. That means what he did for another. What he do? He can it. That means what he did for others. He can do it for you. Say it. That means what he did for others. He can do it for you. Yeah. He can do it for others. Come on. He can do it for you. Come on. If he can do it for others, he can do it for you. Yeah. If he can do it for others, he can do it for you. Come on. If he can do it for others, he can. Come on. Say, get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up, get up out. He picked me, picked me up. He turned me around, placed my feet on solid ground. I thank the Master, I thank the Savior, because He healed my heart, He changed my name, forever free. I'm not the same. I thank the Master, I thank the Savior, and I thank God. Yes, I do. Hell lost another one. Come on, say. Hell lost another one. I am free. I like that. I am free. Yeah. I am free. I like that. Hell lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am free. Hell lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am free. Come on. Hell lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am free. I am free. Come on, 
don't say, hell lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am free. Hell lost another one. I am free. I am free. Come on, do it again. Hell lost another one. I am free. Yeah. I am free. Oh, I am free. Oh, hell lost another one. I am free. I am free. He picked me, come on, he picked me up. He turned me around. He takes my feet on solid ground. I thank the master and I thank the savior. Because you heal my heart. You change my name. Forever free. I'm not the same. I thank the master. I thank the savior. I know the word said hell lost another one. But here's what I like, here's what I like to think about. The devil. Right. Yes, sir. Come on. The deceiver of your soul. And you know what I know? Is right now he could lose another one. Hata brandarabahata. Right now he could lose another one. Because we're speaking to the grave. We're speaking to the, to the one that is trying to drag. There, there's a song that a group sings, I don't have to go to hell. And I want you to know that you don't have to. Hell can lose another one right now. If you're watching on the Ustream, if you're watching us on the internet, or if you're in this building, I'm, I'm going to tell you, I feel that convicting, pulling power of God yeah. to tell somebody here today, you don't have to wait till the altar call. You don't have to wait till 11 o'clock. You don't have to wait till later on. Hell can lose another one. The devil can lose another one right now. Right now. These altars are open. Why don't you push your way out and come and let the hell lose another, another one. one. I am free. The devil, come on. The devil lost another one. The devil lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am sing it again. The devil lost another one. I am free. I am free. Come on, these altars are open. Say, the devil lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am. Come on, sing it again. The devil lost another one. I am free. I am free. I am Don't you free. hold back. The devil lost another one. I am free. Another one. I right, come on. I am free. Come on. I am come on. Free. Oh, the devil has another one. I am free. I am free. I am free. The devil has another one. I am free. I am free. Oh, I am free. The devil has another one. I am free. I am free. He picked me up. He picked me up. I thank the master and I thank the savior because you heal my heart, change my name, forever free. I'm not the same. I thank the master and I thank the savior. Get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. Get 
up, get up, get up. Get up you pick me up, say, you pick me up. You turn me around, you place my feet on solid ground. I thank the master, I thank the savior, because you healed my heart. You changed my name. Thank you, God. Never free, I'm not the same. I thank the master, thank you, master. I thank the savior. Thank you. You turn me around, you place my feet on solid ground. I thank the master, I thank the savior, because you healed my heart, you changed my name, forever free, I'm not the same. I thank the master, I thank the savior. y'all going to tell me I've lost my mind. I'm okay if you tell me I've lost my mind this morning. Jack Hayford was in his church on a Saturday night and the Lord spoke to Jack Hayford and said, Jack, would you dance with me? And Jack said, now, Lord, you know I don't dance. He said, but yeah, but I want you to dance with me. And all alone in that building, Jack Hayford began to twirl. And he began to spin because of the redemption power of God that had touched his life. I'm going to ask you to get out of your box today. If you haven't moved the least little bit, if you've been redeemed, come on now. I, I, I know I'm going to the extreme here, but I want to turn this into a dance floor. Yes, sir. Hey, God, I want to turn this place into a dance floor. That's right. I want the world to know we're going to dance in this place today. Micah told David, I saw you out there losing all your dignity. I saw you when you were out there and you slid off your coat. I saw you out there when you started dancing. He said, woman, I want dancing for you. I was dancing because the glory was coming back. I want to tell somebody today, I'm not dancing for you. I'm dancing for him who saved me, turned me around, set my feet on solid ground. Would you just dance a little bit in this house today? Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. Come on, say, get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. Come on, y'all, get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up, get up out of that grave. out of praise in this place. Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is liberating. This will set you free. What a joy to see these young people dancing and twirling for the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords and singing, hell lost another one. Hell, the devil done lost another one. That ought to make the rest of us want to jump and shout and cry out, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. 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 There's healing power here. There's delivering power here. There's redemptive power here. When you stop thinking about yourself, when you, when you start forgetting about it's all about you and realize that it's all about him, he can do some pretty awesome stuff. And he wants to today. I wonder in this place of worship, is there somebody that would say, Lord Jesus, I want hell to lose another one today. My name is whatever your name is. But that doesn't surprise you, Lord, because you know my name. But I just want to profess with my mouth and confess with my very mouth, my very being, that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of the living God. Somebody pray this with me today. I am so sorry for my sins. I'm a sinner. I need a Savior. Life is just full of heavy bumps. Somebody told me if I'd meet you. Jesus, somebody told me that you could turn my poor wretched life around, place my feet on a solid ground. So today, I boldly confess, my mind is alert. I believe that you are the Christ, the Son of the living God. And from this day forth, I will be a dancer. I will be a lifter of the name of Jesus. I will not be ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ because it is the power of God that has pulled me from the grips of hell. Today I boldly confess that Jesus is Christ, that God raised him from the dead and that he is seated in authority in the very porters of glory. I praise you today, God. I bless you today. Lord, I pray for those in our fellowship, in this fellowship of believers. I pray for our sister Maria. God, that you would continue to give her strength in her body. That same healing powers that is here can go right into that home, right into that bedroom, right into where my sister is at. That same power that is demonstrated in this place can go in room 222 or wherever Brother Thomas Brittenham is right now and fill that room with the power of the Holy Ghost with healing and anointing and encouragement for Margaret and her children and for that family, Lord. God, touch my brother. Give him energy. Give him strength, Lord, beyond his ability. Even now, Lord, 
allow the nutrients to raise him up in his physical body. And may your power, the power of the Holy Spirit, raise him up with healing in Jesus' name. For my sister Belinda, for my brother Glenn, and anybody else that's been through any surgeries or going through tests and surgeries before them, you're the great physician, sir. Thank you, Jesus. You're the great physician. Ah, oh, I feel him. You're the great physician. You're the great physician. Thank you for good doctors and good nurses. But you're the great, mighty physician. Hallelujah. God, thank you. Somebody receive your healing. Somebody feel that energy. We don't have these chairs wired. If you feel a surge, it is the anointing and the power of the Holy Spirit of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. His name He is here. Listen closely. Listen closely. Hear him calling. He knows your name. He knows your name. Manufacture services like this. You can't can't build them. You can't sit around drinking coffee, trying to manipulate some kind of move like this. This is a God thing, <clears throat> and I feel specifically charged. The same charge that I felt when there was an elderly man in the back of the room. His name was Mr. Stetson. And I kept trying to preach and the Lord kept nudging me. I want to heal him. And I would stop in my sermon and I'd say, Brother Stetson, the Lord wants to heal you. Receive your healing in Jesus' name, and I'd go back to preaching. They had to help him in. He was on a walker. And there was two on each side had to help him in that building that day. And about the third time, I got it. When God nudged me in my sermon and said, I don't mean tomorrow. I want to heal him now. So I closed my Bible and I said, Brother Stetson, God wants to heal you now. Would somebody help him in the aisle? 
They put him in the aisle. He was holding to that walker for dear life because of the paralysis in his body, the nerve damage. And I said, God wants to heal you now. My family was there. There were two young ladies sitting in the back of that building that was observing. Two young ladies that had never asked Jesus to come in their heart. They watch. I said, bring him. He's coming down the aisle. Bring him. And he's doing his little walker thing. I told the two on both sides, let him go. I told one on the side, take the walker. God in heaven knows. Deborah, Deborah Burns is his granddaughter. She probably will watch this. She knows. She can comment and verify what I'm saying. It is true in Shalote, North Carolina. They pulled that walker from him, and there he was on his own. Him and God. <laughs> The family was already astonished. They were already crying and clapping. Old Brother Stetson, he was about to get into that thing. Am I telling it? Uh, hey, that was good. But the greatest miracle was when those two girls on the back said, I've been waiting to see God do this. And they ran to the altar and gave their heart and life to the Lord. I wonder, is there any needs in this house that you'll bring them to the altar right now? And in, listen, this is more important than anything we could do. Anybody here today? I feel that same, that same unction. You're dealing with something spiritual, physical, and financial. I want you to come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. The altar, the Father's arms are open. I want you just to stretch out best you can. Come on, come on, get as close as you can. Come on, come on, close as you can. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. Okay, God. Okay, God. Okay, God. Okay, God. Okay, God. The precious blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, oh, Miss Jenny wants to make connection with every one of y'all with the oil. Let me have it first. Miss Jenny. Miss Jenny. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Come to the altar. Oh, come to the altar. The Father's are open wide. Forgiveness was bought with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. 
Shata Karamba Baba Baba Shata Taya. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Hata Baba Shata. Hata Kashanda Lala Baba Shata. Alama Shata Taya. Alama Shata Taya. Ah Shata. Keta Lala Baba Shata Taya. Oh Baba Shata. God, God, in Jesus' name. The Father's arms are open wide. Forgiveness was bought with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. blood of Jesus Christ Oh Oh what a Savior Isn't he wonderful Sing hallelujah Oh God Christ is risen For my brother Thomas my brother Richard stands in proxy for Thomas Brittenham. In the name above every name. God, go in that room right now. Go in the presence of that family right now. God, let your healing virtue do its work. Heal. Heal, God my brother in Jesus name you were wounded for our transgressions you were bruised for our iniquities the chastisement of our peace was upon you and by your stripes we were healed hallelujah Thank you, Lord, for my brother's faith. Thank you for his faith. Thank you for my brother's faith. Isn't he wonderful? Sing hallelujah. Christ is risen. Bow down before him. For he is Lord. Oh, sing hallelujah. Hallelujah. Christ is risen. Oh, come to the Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The altar. The Father's Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Was Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, come to the altar. Oh, come to the oh, altar, God. the Father's arms are open wide. Forgiveness was born with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, hallelujah. Now, Spirit of God. Spirit of the living God. Heal the sick. God, I want to thank you for your healing touch today. And in the name that is above every name, in the name of Jesus. I thank you, Lord, for your power. Thank you for these that have stepped out in faith, believing. Lord, I praise you today. I pray that you'll touch my friend. 
from the top of his head to the sole of his feet. God, we will give you praise and glory and honor as we look to you, sir. I serve notice on hell and the devil. You've lost another one. Hallelujah. I serve notice on hell, the devil, and his imps. Come on, church. I need somebody to help me rejoice. This is my brother. Hallelujah. 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 Lord, heal the sick. Heal the sick. Minister your touch today. Minister your healing touch today. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, I thank you for it, and I call it done. Will you believe with me? Do you agree with me? Come on, let's make a joyful noise. Hell lost another one. I am free. Oh, I am free. Oh, I am free. Hell lost another one. Come on. I am free. Come on, say Any dancers in the free. house? I am free, come yes. on. There was lost another one. I am free, I am free, I am free. Yeah, the devil lost another one. I am free, I am free, I am free. The devil lost another one. I am free, I am free, I am free. Come on, the devil lost another one. I am free, yeah. I am free, oh, I am free, oh, hell lost another one, I am free, I am free, I am free, come on, hell lost another one, I am free, oh, I am free, I, you pick me up, you pick me up, yeah, you turn me around, place my feet on the solid ground, I thank the master, and I thank the savior, because you heal my heart, you change my name, I'm never free, I'm not the same. I thank the master, and I thank the savior, and I thank God. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Come on, you pick me up, say you pick me up, yeah. you turn me around. You place my feet on solid ground. I thank the master and I thank the savior because you heal my heart. You change my name forever free. I'm not the same. I thank the master and I thank the savior and I thank So, so let me get this straight, preacher. So let me, let me make sure I got you right, preacher. You want a soul winning church. And you want a dancing church. I will have failed if we don't become a soul winning, dancing church. I'm not talking about something nasty. Now, here's what I want you to know. Somebody said, well, you know, when I get what God wants me to have, then I'll dance. Uh, that, that ain't how it always works. Sometimes you just start dancing for what you don't have yet. Sometimes you just start dancing for what you don't have yet. Come on, get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Come on, do it Get up, get up, get up. Get up out of that grave. Get up, 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 get up,
you place my feet on solid ground, I thank the Master and I thank the Savior because you healed my heart, you changed my name forever free. I'm not the same. I thank the Master and I thank the Savior. Come on, praise the Lord. If you're visiting with us today, if you're watching through the internet channels, this is a dream come true. We have a mandate to be a soul winning church. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. So don't think it's strange. Don't take it, don't think it's strange. Because we believe in the power. Of the new wine. I, I, just, I just, I, oh, he's talking about wine now. See, that's why, that's why some of y'all remember those days. I could probably point a couple of you out, but I won't. You remember those days when you would start nipping and sipping You wouldn't dance to start with. Y'all know you know who you are. You were all dignified at the party. But then you took a little sip. Pretty soon things that weren't funny started to be funny. <laughs> so I was around a I was around some drunks. I, I know what the effects are. I knew when my daddy drank one beer, two beers, or a shot of liquor. I knew. I could tell by the way he drove in the driveway if he was plastered. But I've been in church long enough to know that there's some folks that's moved away from the new wine. And they got just enough religion to make them miserable. But if I could get you to taste this new wine, y'all know, know where I'm going here. Because I found out that when you take a little sip of it, that's the best. <laughs> Pretty soon, it doesn't take long and you start losing your dignity. He said dance. See what you won't do in the flesh, you'll do in the Holy Ghost. But if, but if you'll just check your heart and check your life, you're still in the flesh. David was determined it hadn't got back yet. But he had tasted from that new wine and he was determined. He was excited about what God was doing that the glory was returning and he just lost all dignity and just danced out of his robe. His wife said, I saw you. The enemy will tell you people are watching you. But if you'll let the new wine of the Holy Spirit get in your veins, you won't care what somebody else thinks. You won't care what somebody... So I'm going, I'm going to tell you that it's a dream come true. Some of you have moved 
just a little bit today. I'll take that. I'll take that. And if you'll keep sipping on the new wine of the Holy Spirit, it won't be long. Your wife will say, what's wrong with you, baby? And then she'll know. And then she'll know. Amen. Amen. Do you praise God for what he's done here this morning? Come on, clap your hands, all ye people. Amen. 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 You can be seated. Dance back to your seats. Hallelujah.